Welcome to Carter's Espanol class. Right. Whoa, look at this audience. I can't get them to quiet down except for right then. They quieted down. Woo, man. Crazy day today, guys. Season two, episode 150 here, okay? Big specials today on the merch. Like and subscribe on the link under my bio. Okay, talking about Tenair today. I need to zoom in here. Tenere means to have. So last unit we worked with Sarah. It had different forms. Yo form, two form, same thing with Tenere. Okay? Again, Tenere is to have. The yo form of Tenere, to say I have, tango. So I could say, tengo la clase de espanol. I have this class. If you want to say you have something, remember two means you, tienes. Tienes. If he or she or you formal has something, tiene. All three forms, tiene. El tiene la clase de arte. If we have something, tenemos. Not John Stamos. Thank you for ask, clarifying that uh, for everyone. If they have or you all have something, tienen. <laughs> Different forms. So these are your subjects. These are the forms of tenere. So based on these three subjects, if yo is my subject, I would put tango. Yo tango. Class A, it says I have class at a certain time. Yo tengo class A at 8 in the morning. Try the next two on your own real quick. Senior Cotter is the same thing as saying L, so we'd say TNA. Mr. Cotter has good students, TNA estudiantes buenos. Nosotros is our subject, so tenemos mucha tarea. We have a lot of homework. That's to say somebody has something. Okay. Down below, if we're saying somebody has to do something, it has a formula here. A form of tenere, like tango or tienes or tiene, plus k. An infinitive means a verb, because that would be the to do part. Like, I have to study, that's the thing I have to do. Or you have to take notes, etc. Okay? So, looking at a few here, los estudiantes is our subject. The first thing we need is a form of tener. Los estudiantes is just like saying ellos. So the form of tener I'm going to use is tienen. Los estudiantes tienen. The second part of our formula is que. Tienen K. And then estudiar is our verb. So this says the students have to study or they have to study. Okay. Try doing number two on your own, and then I'm going to write a couple examples while you're doing number two. So three and four are up on the board also. If you want to give those a try, please.
First blank, four of Tenere. Second blank will be K. And then it gives you the verb. So, uh, number two, El Chico is the same thing as L. So I'd say El Chico, T N A K, has to. This is what the boy has to do. You have to, tu tienes que, take notes, tu tienes que tomar apuntes. Marcos tiene que contestar. He has to answer. So again, this is if you have to do something. If you're just saying, I have Spanish class, you're not saying I have to do anything. So we wouldn't throw in K. Okay. Questions with Tenere. Special thank you to everyone. We're up to over 100 followers. I couldn't do it without you. Actually, I could because I have to, but I'm under contract. But thank you anyway. Bye, everybody.